That's my third coyote from this set. Uh, I've got another one down here. So that's four coyotes from these two spring hole sets. It's a good dog there. So when we had our first snow, I could see the coyotes are crossing this road here. They, they go right up in here. Um, so right before we had that last rain, I don't know, was that Tuesday? I don't know. But, um, they came up here right before the rain. And I put a trap right, right there. And, uh, and then we got the rain and it turned to snow. We got a little more snow, blended in nice. That uh, should catch something soon. But I can see the coyotes came in. I don't know if you see it on here. They came in and er, put on the brakes right there. One more step would have been in my trap. And put on the brakes and turned around and went back. And then instead they came out over here. I was like, you got to be kidding me, man. Uh, they must smell the trap or something tipped them off. Man, the coyotes are killing me. Well, <clears throat> yesterday coyote was coming down that trail and put on the brakes when it got to my trap but uh today I see a coyote went through there just didn't step on the pan that's a good sign There's only one coyote very different before there was a pair um but that's good uh, that one didn't smell nothing I guess and the next one that comes through is more likely to, you know, it's going to help cover the, <coughs> it's going to leave coyote scent there, so, I don't know, see what happens. Well, I got a double on raccoon, spring hole sets, got one down there, springs over there, it's got a chain slide, brings them over, and I got another one up here, Little coon, springs over there. Wanted coyotes, but I don't know. This is that uh, stream set where I pulled the beaver carcass up underneath those roots. And as you can see, it's frozen up solid. Um, bobcats been, been all over the place. All these smells. There's a bait under there. I don't know where it is or how to get to it. He's been, been looking for it. And we're supposed to have some warm weather coming up, so maybe this will uh, melt off. I don't know. Um, I think this weekend is supposed to get rain, 50 degrees. Might melt this off. Might go reset that. It's still set under there. I come through here anyway, so I'm just gonna leave it. And uh, if the weather gets warm, we'll be working again. I'll chop out the ice and uh, get it working again but uh, we'll see don't have too much faith in it uh getting warm enough to open that up if it doesn't i'll probably chop it out and uh, uh there's another spot down below here a, a spring that i can set it set it in uh, this is a spot i'm thinking about setting up um been real cold, it froze up a little bit, but it's spring fed up above. Um, but this spot right here, I've had coyotes crossing right here and a bobcat. Um, I'm thinking if I can get a stake in there and get my bait in there and then put right about there, have a foothold, um, a little moss on it. It's a natural crossing spot, it's a little shallower there. Um, that'd be a good setup right there. Uh, maybe with this warm weather, I'll try and get something in here. Okay, so uh, yesterday and today, we got a little warm spell. So uh, 
This is where I have that beaver up under that tree and the stream set. So what I did is I busted up all the ice here. There's a good three inches of ice. Busted it all up and pulled it out of here. And water levels up a little bit, so I built this up and reset my trap. Um, one, one thing that's very important that you have to do is make sure your the chain slide is, is freed up. You know, I had ice all up in here along this bank like there. Um, if I caught something, it wouldn't be able to go up the chain slide. It, it was frozen up in here, so I had to get rid of all that and free up my chain slide. And that'll be something to have to keep an eye on. As soon as it gets cold, the edge is going to freeze. You have to make sure that chain slide is freed up where it's uh, along the edge. Um, so, uh, maybe I'll make a catch here. Uh, probably only, I don't know, it's supposed to get a little cold again, but this weekend's supposed to be warm and rain, so might be able to keep this going. I don't know, see how high the water level goes. But, uh, see what happens. Big coyote in my bridge set. Farmer's gonna be happy about this. Been killing his animals left and right. Well, payment for trapping coyotes. A couple wild boar the farmer gave me. I was happy I caught that dog. <laughs>